So next is the concept of the fees and charges. Next we'll talk about trailer fees. Trailer fee is an annual percentage which is paid by the client from the return also besides the management fee or the load charges. Uh, this is based off of the percentage of assets and the purpose is for ongoing services to the investors. So it includes investment advice, tax guidance, and statements. So the, the investment advisor is supposed to review the returns and the performance with the client on an annual basis. And for that purpose, they get a trailer fee. It could be from 0.25% to 1% of the value. Furthermore, the um, fees and charges of mutual funds. There are other, it's also good to know, crucial to note that sales charges indicated in the fund facts are the maximum charges and the investors can negotiate the lower charges. Mutual fund must pay to the investment company's operating expenses in addition to the management fee and most mutual funds with some type of sales charge now give client the choice of paying either a front-end fee or a back-end fee, but not both. So the other fees also, there's, there is, for most mutual funds, there is an early redemption fee. The early redemption fee is fees paid when investors sell units within 90 days of purchasing. And so this is just to prevent people from buying and selling quickly, the mutual funds, because it is a long-term investment. And this could be $100 or it could be 2% of the value. So early redemption fee must be disclosed to the client so they know that. Other fees, if you open up RSP, RIF or RESP, there could be trustee fees for that. There could be setup fees, first time, one time fee for investors. There could be account closing fee. And uh, when you're closing the mutual fund account, sometimes it is waived if closed because of death. Then there are transfer or switching fees. So when switching investments from one fund to another, um, there could be a fee and frequent trading charge. If you are going to buy and sell a lot of funds, then there could be a charge there also. And we mentioned already trading commission or service fee, um, and that also is there. So these all fees do add up and they are all included in the mutual fund.